for the Chicago Bulls as they have now avenged the three defeats that they have suffered this year. They defeated the Orlando Magic, the Indiana Pacers, and tonight, the Chicago Bulls defeat the Seattle Sonics by a score of 113 to 87, and let's send you out on the floor to Craig Sager. Michael talking to his North Carolina teammate, Sam Perkins. Michael, obviously a great game. 14 rebounds, that's the season high, the legs are there. Well, Gene is working me back, so I figured I had to go in there and record and kind of uh, help him out a little bit. And uh, I, I think we all, we, we played a better second half than what we did out of Seattle. Nobody expects this team to ever lose a game. What challenge is it for you guys to finish with the best record in history? Well, our challenge is to just try to be the best team that we can be. I mean, no matter who we face, we just want to come out and play our style of game and control the game, control the tempo, and just continue to improve and play a complete 48-minute basketball game. All right, thanks, Mike. Let's go from one MVP to the other. Let's go to Scotty Pippen, who's now with Dick and Chuck. All right, and we'll have Scotty with us, uh, getting his breath right now, and we'll be back with uh, the Scotsman after this break. <laughs> Up someday, Scotty. I know it. Tell me the truth now. No, no, not at all, Dick. Thanks. <laughs> what about tonight's game? You came out like a house of fire, and again, you avenged uh, one of the three uh, setbacks you've had all year. Well, this is one of those games where we tried to get off early. We knew that we had to get off to a good start. We've had a long layoff since we played, so... My job tonight was really try to get the team going early so we didn't really get into a slump and let this team get out on us. What, what is the challenge for this club now? I mean, there are so many winnable games coming up. Where is the challenge going to be? Because mentally you've got to have it. You're going to continue this. Well, I think the challenge for us really is stay focused. You know, you can't get uh, kind of relaxed when you start winning games. So we went staying pretty focused, taking one game at a time. We realized that, you know, we're on a great ride right now, and we're enjoying it, and hopefully we can keep it going. Well, you've got a great schedule. You've gotten a lot of these teams on a back-to-back, -back, along with the fact that, here's a case, you were Saturday to Saturday, you only had one game. Well, it is, and it gives us the opportunity to really prepare on some things that we need to do. I think we realize that our record is great, and we've had a good time winning, but we still know there's a lot of execution things that we got to do out on the basketball court, and I think the practice has really helped. Scotty, let me ask you about Dennis Rodman, who's been a great teammate, but uh, kind of lost a little bit. Uh, maybe, uh, uh, maybe he was right in doing so. Uh, what was your feeling about, uh, you know, uh, Dennis uh, being ejected? Tonight? Well, it was tough. You know, we tried to keep Dennis going in the game. You know, he got a couple bad calls, and it kind of frustrated him. You know, uh, I just didn't want him to continue to ride the officials where they're have some type of decision probably to make him miss the next game. But, you know, we need Dennis out on the court. His presence definitely needed. And, you know, I tried to do all I could to keep him in the game. But that second of technical really, you know, kind of took us out. But I think when he left, it really enthused the crowd and it really got us going. Scotty, tell me, you know, away from the X's and O's of basketball, how much fun this is playing with this team. Are you savoring how great it is to go through the season right now? Where it is. You know, you really don't want to cherish anything until you've had a kind of reached the end and really where you've accomplished something. But this is great. It's a great ride. We're on the fans here supporting us very well. We're playing good basketball on our home court as well as on the road. And uh, we're just having fun. You know, hopefully this ride can continue and never stop. You better make some of these games closer. <laughs> Nobody's going to show up. <laughs> I tell you what. Our viewers stay with us all the way because how great you guys are. Still perfect at home. Thanks, Thanks Scotty. Thanks a lot, Dave. Thanks for another Thanks, good Scott. game. And we'll be back here at the United Center in just one moment.